Hi, I'm Paige Steers. We are here at the Crew Network Convention in Chicago talking to experts, and I am with Susan Hill. We're talking about the debt and equity environment, and let's let's look at CMBS, because interesting, by September of this year, issuance at $31 billion. That's ahead of the $27 billion we saw in September of 2001. So will we see a post-recession high at a CMBS this year? I don't know if we'll, yes, we will definitely see a post-recession high. I think the year will end about $40 billion. The interesting thing on the securitized market, what we've seen in the last, I'd say the last 30 days is really a compression in spreads um, of about 40 to 50 basis points. And that those that paper right now is trading all in. You can do 75% leverage and it's priced around 4% versus, you know, 30, 60 days ago, that was at four and a half. So it has brought a great amount of liquidity to the market. There are quite a few transactions that are going to be slated to be securitized by the end of the year. It'll be interesting to see how those deals price as typical you know markets in December a lot of people like to rest and get to the sidelines so it'll be interesting how that paper you know clears the market but we think it's going to be good and I think it'll be good for 2013 I think that they're estimating the CMBS market will be around that 50 to 60 if you're billion um, if you're very optimistic but um, it'll be good for 2013 because it does bring a source of liquidity to the market that we need because they are searching for transactions that the other lenders are not looking at, um, like the live companies and the banks. Yeah, they'll take a little more risk on maybe some secondary markets. So what does that do for competition? And if CMBS is back and it's aggressive, what are the life companies doing? So that's a very good question, Paige. And the life companies, for the very first time, are starting to see competition from the CMBS lenders because of the pricing. Yeah. But again, you know, the life companies typically deploy their capital early. They typically go after the core assets. And there's still a market out there there of institutional investors that don't want to play the securitized game because as we all know life after a securitized loan is not exactly the same as a life company so the life co company market I think will end up in that 50 billion range this year that's a very healthy range for them that's probably what they will be doing in 2013 and they will um, take care of their rollovers as existing clients typically go back to them to do their maturities so there will be enough product I think for everybody. Well, that's good news for the 20 2013 market as well and there's also good news here at Crew because it, there's a lot of optimism I'm seeing here at the conference and you are the president-elect 2013. So what can we expect from the new administration? Yeah, I think it's great. Um, there is, like you said, a lot of optimism here. There's a lot of energy. It's great. I am hopeful that we're going to build off that. We're going to grow our memberships and we're really going to focus on making our chapters strong in the markets that we are in and really targeting some markets maybe that we're not in that we should be in. Okay, well this is definitely the environment to be. If you want to get deals done and network. So thank you for sharing your expertise with us today. Absolutely. Thank you for having me here.